Okay, in this video, we're going to factor the following expression, and we're going to use method 4, slide and divide. And in the description box of this video, there's a playlist where I go over several different methods, including slide and divide. And so let's begin. So with this method, I want to get this piece to be an x squared. So what I'm going to do is divide by 2. And so this changes to an x squared. Negative 3x remains the same. Now this is called slide and divide. So I'm going to slide this 2 over here. And I'm going to get negative 2 times 2 and get negative 4. Now obviously, this and this is not equivalent. But we're going to do something at the end to address that. And so at this point, I'm just going to factor this piece right here. And because it's an x squared, it's a lot easier. So I have x parentheses, x parentheses. We think what two numbers multiply to give us negative 4, but add to give us negative 3. That's going to be negative 4 plus 1, because 1 times negative 4 is negative 4. Likewise, 1 minus 4 is negative 3. And now we need to address this piece right here. So what I'm going to do next is take our 1 divided by 2, take our negative 4 divided by 2. And if it can simplify, great. So for example, x minus 4 divided by 2. We could get negative 4 divided by 2 gives us a negative 2. So this piece right here, it becomes x minus 2. Now this piece, 1 divided by 2, because we have a fraction and we're using this method, this 2, we bring it to the front. So now what we get is 2 times x, so 2x plus 1. And so this right here is your final answer. We can just double check. x times 2x is 2x squared. It matches. x times 1 is 1x. Negative 2 times 2x is negative 4x. So negative 4x plus 1x is negative 3x, so it matches. Likewise, negative 2 times 1 is negative 2. And so it's a match. And if you want more practice, check out the description box for more videos. And that's pretty much it for this video.